On January 27, 2022, police went to check on a forgery and child abuse report. Someone at FedEx told them they were asked to print a bunch of fake driver's licenses. When the police looked into it, they caught the suspects engaging in intercourse with each other and smoking while a child was present in the room. Sending these in here. Now, if I started looking at these, and they look okay, but if you look at that, that uh, driver's license number, the date of birth, like the name right here is too far apart. Uh -huh. So he sends another email fixing that one problem. But here, the driver's license name, the driver's license number is the same. Uh -huh. The date of birth are different. Interesting. So are the names. Are and then th that same guy, th these are him correcting the other Everybody. mistakes on him. And that's him correcting his name on this one. You can see he sent it. The names are better. And then this is the last guy to come in and pick these up. But this guy doesn't even have a full driver's license number. Yeah, no, definitely. And the same email is sending them. So my, my LP guy just somebody calls oh, Yeah, definitely. Do you have uh, the you have email right Yeah. Can you copy After tracking the forgers for several weeks, the officers gathered enough proof and then went ahead and made the arrest. For what? Um, there's going to be a variety of different things you just saw. You remember me, man? I took your stolen car that one day? Yeah. Can I tell my wife? She's inside, man. Yeah, inside? Okay, yeah. we're gonna knock on the door real quick. What about the kids? Are the kids in there? Yeah, the kids are everybody's there. Yeah. How many kids are there? I was two there. I got three all together, but there's two inside. Where's the oldest? Uh, he's with the grandparents. He lives with them? Uh, mainly, yeah, because we were the, living through the motels for a while, so he's been there. He's basically staying over there, so. Okay. You, this is the police department. You need to open the door. We're gonna boot it. Ms. Franco, we have a search warrant for the residents. Open the door. Hey, what's up? Can you open the door, please? Yeah. Yeah, we're looking for you. We're coming in, okay? Me? Yeah. Come on, this way, of course. Hey, kids. Is anybody else here? We don't either, bro. We just showed up. Let's check his stuff real quick. Do you have anything on you that I should be worried about? Mama! Mama, it's okay. It's okay, I promise. It's okay, baby. It's okay, baby. Mama! 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 M
Hold on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We'll figure something out. We'll call my kids. We're just hanging out we're right, right now. We don't even something. know what's going on yet. Mm -hmm. We also have a warrant to search your residence. During the course of the fraud investigation, we had access to both of your phones. Uh -huh. Just uh, uh, lean up against the corner. Right I'm sorry? Because in real estate, the state decides that your mom can't have them and do that. I knew. No, anyway, my, my mom needs to see my kids. Please, they, they can't do it. I understand. You can't, can I tell them you by can't please? allow them here. No, no, those are my babies. Stephanie, watch them, please. Who's that? Hey, Call get away mom. from that door. Get away from that door. You want some clothes, buddy? His mom, Yvonne and Jerry, mom and maternal grandma and grandpa. I think he's got a warrant too. That's what they just showed up. The detectives oh, called us. That's why we just showed up. Because we're just here to transport he you guys. Okay, that's definitely something you want to let them. Because I don't even know what's going on. We're, he's checking with the dispatch to see what your warrants are for. Well, he's already telling her that your parents are an option. I know that I don't, I don't look very fit because my house is crazy, crazy. Okay. At least for my parents, please, my baby. Okay. Everything. Well, they're already asking about, do your parents have any previous CYFD stuff? <coughs> your parents don't get in trouble, never been arrested? My mom's other job. She works at MSU. My dad's on disability. He stays from there. Okay, so they've never had my any, son like... My stays with them, I shouldn't. Oh, okay. The, and was that through CPS? No, Did they take no, your kid no, in? No, he just no. goes to school and, and... Over there? Yeah. Okay. Well, that's something that they're going to look at, you know what I'm saying? Please let me know that my kids are all right. Yeah. Um, and this is exactly who's the person that's going to make those decisions, you know what I'm saying? So, we're going to try to... Yeah, yeah. We're going to try to place with your family for five days. Well, we oh, with my family? family? Yes. Yeah, that's what she's yes. saying. Like, they're oh, going to see what's going on. Else. No, no, no. But first, I need to try with your family. But the only thing is I need to check with your, with your dad and see what that battery charge is about. And if we can, you know, if we can be okay with that, or my superiors can be okay with that, then we can do a safety plan. But you would have to agree not to pick up the kids and agree to uh, drug test the kids. Could you agree to that? To pick up, not to pick up the kids? Really? Not to pick up the kids. If you get out tomorrow, let's say you cannot pick up the kids until you talk to me, and then you would have to agree to drug test the kids. No. My warrant also covers the cell phones. All of the different Oh, my phones are gone? All the cell phones and electronic devices. We're going to have to go through that house. I'm that's, just asking no, if fine. you want to tell me where they're at so that we can grab them. I don't have them. any. I, don't have, I have one. I There's one, one laying on the couch. I yeah, that one it. might be. Uh, I have two. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, shit. Come on. In a minute, a few years. Yeah. All right, ma'am, she just finished the safety plan, so I guess that five day thing is going to go through with your parents. Okay, so they're going to go to my Yes, yeah, so they're going to go to your parents for the five days, and then after, or during that five days, they're going to drug test them and they're going to do all kinds of other stuff or some shit like that. They're going to see if the five days is going to pan out or what's going to happen with you. Yeah, she's going to come over here. I'm just letting you know what's going on because I know you're really worried about your kids going with your parents. So she's going to get you to sign a safety plan for that and she'll explain more. But I just want to put you a little bit at ease that she's going to square that away. So when you're done with her, you'll probably go to the station so you can talk further with the lieutenant. How's my buddy, uh, what's his name? Carol. What's that? He's in the gym. Well, you'll see him right now. Probably. He's still being bucky. Is he getting no bun on his too? Yeah, it's the same. I think you guys have the same two charges. So. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Oh my god.